I want to show you a really awesome add-on that I just found recently that addresses a workflow issue in Blender that really was kind of driving me a little bit nuts. Whenever you're working in a different tab, layout, modeling, sculpting, etc., each one of the 3D viewports has their own independent settings. And on the face of it, that seems like a really good thing because you may have different view requirements for each of the tabs. But in practice, a lot of times you actually want to maintain from working tab session to working tab session the same or very, very similar 3D view. So for instance, if I switch over here to sculpting, the view camera is way back and you've got to come over and you've got to zoom in and you've got to find and isolate the object that you're wanting to work on in the scene. Then as soon as you switch over to UV editing, then the view is different here and you've got to spend time getting it back into something similar to what you were working on before. And it really is a challenge. And this is especially a challenge when I'm switching over to shading and then I switch back to, say, modeling. What I found was this awesome synchronized workspaces add-on over on Gumroad. And the great thing is it's free. So just go ahead and download it. And we're going to come over and we're just going to install it, which it downloads, keep it as a zip file, and then you just go through the install process for add-ons. That's all you got to do. Now, I've already got it installed, so I'm going to come over here and find it. And I'm going to enable Synchronize Workspaces. And what it does is it simply adds a new menu on the far right side right after the shading, because it really kind of belongs over here in the view manipulation area. By default, it's turned itself on, and what it's going to do is it's going to synchronize the view between each of these areas. If you don't want it to synchronize in a particular one, you can obviously turn that off. So let's come over now. We're in modeling, so now if I switch over to, say, sculpting, it maintains that. If I come over to UV editing, it's maintained that. If I come over to shading, it's maintained that. Now, the, the view modes may be different. But this really is nice because it just maintains the working relationship in the 3D viewport that you want to be working on. And that's the case that I often find. So now when I switch over to, let's say, modeling in this case, it maintains that. Or UV editing, and it's maintained that for me. So I just wanted to show you this really quickly as an option that you can play with. And the, the nice thing is you can temporarily toggle it off. If you don't want it to happen on a global scale for all of your tabs, you can temporarily turn it off. I really like it.